Mike, I need your help. Seriously, I desperately need your help. This is my house, built in 1886. I moved in here in July. It is now the end of February, and I have been desperately working to try and restore this beautiful home filled with all kinds of architectural interests, beautiful pocket doors, lovely coal burning fireplaces, huge windows that of course somebody who lived here before painted and destroyed. Just massive woodwork everywhere, doors and doors and doors. I had a contractor who I've told you about in uh, my little written section who just destroyed everything that I was trying to rehab here. And I need your help, I really do. We had a staircase here that was torn out and um, completely left unfinished. We added a bunch of, bunch of things to this kitchen and there's obviously a lot of unfinished issues everywhere. Um, put in my beautiful old magic chef that was from the early 1900s. And I just, I need help with all of this unfinished work and all of the things that this contractor screwed up. Um, the biggest thing being the addition that he tried to build to give me access into the basement and it's left completely unfinished. This is the worst winter ever, sub-zero temperatures and my house has a wide open gaping hole in the back of it which makes for some lovely heating bills. And my little guy, Gideon, and I live here by ourselves. I'm a single mom. He's two and a half. Loves to go in the basement. <laughs> I will go in the basement! Okay, we'll go in the basement in a minute. No. So really, this is just, oh, I'm sorry, go ahead. This is my plight. This is my begging you for assistance. Please come and help me make this house into what it could be. Please help me restore it back to what it should have been help me fix the contractor's mistakes, help me turn it into the gorgeous home that it was and should be. Thank you. We love you, Mike. Come and help us in Rockford, Illinois.